In today's discussion, we're going to delve into recent developments involving significant figures in the financial world, highlighting the potential repercussions of their actions. Firstly, there's news surrounding the imminent arrest of U.S. hedge fund manager, William Cameron Morton, following allegations of concealing a staggering $533 million from lenders associated with an Indian education technology startup. This issue has escalated to the point where a U.S. bankruptcy judge has issued an arrest warrant against Morton, who is facing daily fines of $10,000 for non-cooperation with the court. The funds in question were originally lent to Baiju, which subsequently invested them in Morton Hedge Fund, Camshaft Capital. However, Morton's refusal to comply with legal proceedings has led to accusations of misappropriation and theft. Hey, welcome to AMC Daily. If you are new to the channel, be sure to subscribe to the channel and turn on post notifications by hitting the bell. So you never miss any of our uploads and also enter our giveaway. But everyone remember this is not a financial advice video. While Morton case is making headlines, it raises questions about the accountability of other high-profile figures in the financial sector, such as Ken Griffin. Despite allegations of more severe wrongdoing, Griffin has yet to face similar legal consequences. However, given the precedent set by cases like Bernie Madoff, where immediate arrest followed the cessation of fraudulent activities, it's conceivable that Griffin and others may soon find themselves in legal jeopardy. As regulatory scrutiny intensifies, hedge funds like Citadel may find themselves facing increased pressure and potential legal action. In addition to Morton Troubles, there's also news concerning the downfall of Alpine Securities Corporation, a once prominent market maker and clearinghouse in the U.S. Alpine failure to meet margin requirements has prompted the National Securities Clearing Corporation NSCC to consider revoking its operating privileges, effectively forcing it out of the securities market. Despite Alpine attempts to secure an emergency halt to address its capital deficiencies, these efforts have been unsuccessful. This development could signal the beginning of a broader trend, with other market makers facing similar challenges and potential collapse in the coming months. Furthermore, recent events have shed light on the risks associated with leveraged trading strategies employed by hedge funds. One such example is a hedge fund that incurred a billion-dollar loss by betting against MicroStrategy expecting its stock to decline following the success of a Bitcoin exchange-traded fund F. However, MicroStrategy stock outperformed expectations, resulting in significant losses for the hedge fund and underscoring the dangers of overleveraging. The financial markets have also experienced disruptions, as evidenced by the recent technical issues that temporarily halted trading on major exchanges like the NASDAQ and the New York Stock Exchange NYSE. While these incidents were eventually resolved, they raise concerns about the vulnerability of the market infrastructure to systemic failures. Moreover, there are fears that similar disruptions could occur during periods of market volatility, potentially exacerbating ongoing crises like the AMC short squeeze. Speaking of which, there are developments regarding AMC Entertainment Holdings Inc.'s efforts to manage its debt obligations, despite concerns about the company's ability to repay its debts due in 2026. AMC is exploring options to restructure its debt with more favorable terms, including lower interest rates. This strategic move could alleviate financial pressures on AMC and enhance its profitability, dispelling doubts about its long-term viability. In conclusion, the financial landscape is rife with uncertainty and volatility, driven by the actions of key players like hedge fund managers, market makers, and corporate entities. As regulatory scrutiny intensifies and market dynamics evolve, it's essential for investors to remain vigilant and informed about the potential risks and opportunities in the ever-changing financial environment. Guys, that's all we have for you today. What is your opinion about AMC stock? Get involved and let us know in the comments down below. Thank you for watching.